the settings keep stopping error that's bothering some owners of the Galaxy A50, isn't like any app crashes, because settings is a core application that covers almost every app, feature, and service on your device. If it crashes, the problem could be with the firmware. It can be minor but it can also be pretty serious. Hey guys, I'm RJ from TheCellGuy.com, and in this video, I will be showing you what to do if settings crashes on your phone. First solution, launch settings in safe mode. The purpose of this is to know if the problem is caused by some third-party applications. Running the phone in safe mode temporarily disables all downloaded apps. If the problem does not occur in safe mode, then it means there's an app that's causing it. Here's how you start your phone in safe mode. Press and hold the power key until options show. Tap and hold the power off option until it changes into safe mode. Tap the safe mode icon to restart your device. Once the reboot is successful, you should see safe mode at the lower left corner of the screen. While your Galaxy A50 is in this mode, try to see if settings still crashes. If the problem is fixed, then it means the problem is caused by one or some of your downloaded apps. Find those apps and uninstall them. However, if the problem continues even in this mode, then move on to the next solution. Second solution, wipe the cache partition of your device. Doing this will delete the old cache and replace it with a new one. It's a very effective solution against this kind of problem, and here's how you do it. Turn your phone off first. Press the volume up button and the power key at the same time, and release them when the Galaxy A50 logo shows. Once you see a black screen with yellow and blue texts on it, you've successfully started the phone up in recovery and mode. Now, using the volume down key, highlight the option wipe cache partition and then press the power key to select it. Highlight yes and then press the power key. When it's finished, the option reboot system now is already highlighted. Just press the power key to select it and restart your device. Wait for your phone to finish rebooting. If the problem continues after this, then you have to do the next solution. Third solution, master reset your phone. As long as the firmware has not been modified, a master reset will fix this problem, but you may lose some of your files and data. If you want to proceed with it, here's how you do it. Turn your phone off. Press the volume up button and the power key at the same time, and release them when the Galaxy A50 logo shows. Once you see a black screen with yellow and blue texts on it, you've successfully started the phone up in recovery and mode. Now, using the volume down key, highlight the option wipe data or factory reset and then press the power key to select it. Highlight yes and then press the power key. When it's finished, the option reboot system now is already highlighted. Just press the power key to select it and restart your device. Wait for your phone to finish rebooting. After the reset, set up your phone as a new device. Please support us by subscribing to our channel and enabling notifications. Thanks for watching.